Hey, how's it going guys? Rudy Hernandez here. I apologize for having this video sent out so late. I was sick for the past few days, but I'm better now, so I'm good to go. All right, jumping right into it. So how to get paid more. So like we said, um, you're in your current position, you know, let's say you're entry level, you've been doing it for, you know, zero to six months, you're barely starting out. Uh, how do you get that higher pay rate? So the, these are next three are gonna be definitely put you on that fast track to get towards that higher paying position. Number one is know your job. So what I mean by that is, whatever position you're in, make sure that you know exactly what you need to be doing. You should know your roles, responsibilities, you should be going over your SOPs, which are your standard operating procedures, your policy, and checking in with your supervisor to make sure you do you are doing exactly what you need to be doing. Um, and also, uh, make sure that you're doing the job right. So once you define what your position is, what your roles and responsibilities are, and you've read through all the policy, you've read through all the SOPs, you know what you're supposed to be doing, whether you're what you're supposed to be doing, what you're not supposed to be doing, and then also checking in with your supervisor, make sure you're actually doing the job. So just because you know something doesn't mean you're actually doing it. So make sure that once you know what you're supposed to be doing, uh, make sure you actually do it. And then um, within that category is do the job right. Make sure that you're doing the job um, to the best of your ability and to the exceptional standards in the eyes of your supervisors and your clients. Um, number two, be that go-to person. Um, you know, I've come across some people over the years that if I ask them a question, it doesn't necessarily relate to their job description. You know, they go ahead and give me the, ah, uh, that's not my job. Don't be that guy. You know, uh, try to find out information or at least tell people, it's like, you know what, that's a good question. Let me find out for you or something along the lines. But you don't want to have that reputation where when somebody comes to you, you're the, I don't know guy or you're the, ah, uh, that's not my job. Be the, you know what, let me find out. Be the go-to person to whether either you know the information and it doesn't necessarily relate to your job description, but like I said, that adds value to you and that makes you an asset. And it'll def definitely give you some brownie points in the eyes of the client or your supervisor. Uh, number three is progressing. So definitely seek out more training. Any training that you could take, any certifications you could get, I highly recommend them. Uh, one, you can add them to your resume, they make you look good, and it also shows that you're taking proactive steps to better yourself within your position. And like I said, uh, this, that's something that in a management level, that's what I wanna see. I wanna see people that are in entry level positions um, taking time, making the effort to know their job and to do the job. And like I said, to always be progressing, always exceed uh, what's expected of them. And like I said, it may not seem like a lot at that point, but if you definitely want to move up, uh, you know, the corporate ladder, so to speak, even though that entry level position is paying you, whether it's minimum wage, just above minimum wage, whatever it is, you're gaining that needed experience so you can take that next step, like what we talked about in prior videos. Uh, so like I said, Definitely don't stay stagnant, dead in the water. Um, always look to progress with uh, extra training, certifications, and whatever have you. So other than that, guys, like I said, just wanted to put this quick video out. I appreciate you. Uh, stay safe, and thank you. Go and do likewise, gents. The money's out there. You pick it up, it's yours. You don't, I got no sympathy for.